So, you know, I, I should be editing things or continue to edit the thing that I was editing that I stopped midway on or, you know, just do anything else that needs to be done rather than doing a video right now. But hey, I'm a bad guy, so I figured why not. Also, I wanted a break. That's the more important part. I wanted a break. Also, I really, really hate, uh, really hate waiting to, like, if I, if I feel like let's playing something in the day, I really hate having to wait for a rendering to be done, so. All of that combined means you guys get a video. Yes! It's not actually anything special. Moving on, I think this is the last one of Erica's missions, which is good, because it means we'll be able to go back to Ephraim. Which I'm totally sure that is not how you pronounce his name, but you know what, I've grown to like that pronunciation, and so I shall continue to pronounce it that way. Especially because any other pronunciation will make literally no sense to me, because A, I've gotten used to this one, and B, his name just looks extremely weird, and I don't understand how anybody would know how to pronounce that. Just saying. So let's move on, and let's finish up this final thing. It looks like we're going to Jahana. I think we established that last time. And I think we said that Kalik, because of prior events, probably the Prince of Jahana, right? That sounds like something we would have went over. I think that's what he was. This game sounds loud to me, which means my headset's up a little bit. That's depressing. Oh no, we didn't buy equipment! <laughs> well, alright. Thanks to the arrival of reinforcements from Princess La Rachel of Ralston. Erika and her allies successfully repelled the Grado invaders, also Pablo's remnants. Still, Jahana Hall remains under siege, on the edge of ruin. En route, Erika learns that the hall has indeed been captured by Grado, because an entire country sucks- an entire country filled with mercenaries sucks really bad at fighting. One has to wonder how those mercenaries get jobs. Huh, that reminds me. Last game, Ilya. That's the place that the mercenaries are from. Totally got conquered. Pfft. Pegasus Knights are terrible at defending. Anyway, moving on. To rescue Queen Izmir and recover Jahana's sacred stone, assuming that it hasn't been broken already, which I would have assumed that it has been, but whatever. Erika leads an assault on the Royal Hall. whoop de doo Now, I don't think we have any supplies left. Chapter 14, Queen of the White Dunes. I will put the the there. Complimentary. It is 100% free. You have no down payment needed. We have a two years ago scene. Flashback! I yield. The point is yours, Erica. You're swift, aren't you? Compared to you, I'm... <laughs> I'm convinced I've been bested at fencing by a woman. Pitiful crown prince, am I not? That's not true. Oh no, Erica. It is. The people need a strong ruler. They don't want a weakling like me. They want the strength you and Ephraim share. My body is frail. I prefer to spend my time locked away in the castle reading. Yo! Okay, your body can be as frail as it wants. Strength isn't measured in physical prowess. Strength of character is all your people need, man! Yeah! Alright, done with that. I think my father would be better served if someone else took my place. I'm sure all of our retainers feel the same. You're wrong, Leon. An emperor without compassion will never hold the people's love. And one day, your compassion will surely save us all. Foreshadowing? Question mark. Cross hates it whenever I say question mark after, after a thing. He really hates those pronounced question marks. One of the reasons why I like, I like to do them. I believe that. Erica, thank you. Yes, I... I will do my best. Even though I lack your strength, there must be some good I can do. There is. By the way, Erica, if it... If it pleases you, would you accept this? Totally need an S there. Come on, localization. You're forgetting one letter. <sighs> That's damn near criminal. Criminal. I can't even pronounce the word, that kind of makes me sad. Princess Erica, is there something wrong? No, it's nothing. Jahana Hall has been completely occupied by Grado soldiers. I'm sorry to report that Queen Ismir is already... And the one giving orders to the troops in the palace is Crown Prince Leon? Oh yeah, that's right, Leon is here. Whoops! 
What is there to give us pause? Should we not storm the palace and retake it by strength of arms? Fralia's spy network reports that Prince Leon is an initiate of dark magic. If this is true, even approaching him will be a serious challenge. Oh, please. Every fire em Most of the fire emblems... Yeah, most would be proper. Most of the fire emblems to this point use dark magic as major villain, as either a major villain or a major enemy in the whole story. We have we have practice as the player. It's a fire emblem. We know what we're getting into. Just let us go kick his ass. Well, he's probably level 20. Never mind. He m might be a little bit challenging. Make up a reason why we don't have to fight him yet. And then let us go storm the castle. I'd heard the prince dislikes violence. However, it could have all been a ruse. Still, if we don't retake the palace, we've no hope of defeating Grado. We must rescue the queen, no matter the cost. I understand. Let's go! Why did he ever get saddled with that horrible voice, Eins? Hey look, she's alive! Queen Ismir, please do not resist. I have no desire to see you harmed. Carly. Car Carly? Carlisle? It's one of those. Carlisle, Carly. I'm just gonna go Carly. Carly, why have you betrayed us? After all these years of loyal service as Jahan's most as Jahana's most decorated commander. Without you, I could not have ruled these long years since my husband's passing. It was through your unwavering support alone that I still sit upon the throne. You are the cornerstone of Jahana, or as Pennsylvanians would say, the keystone! Ah! Okay. You have heard my trust more than any other ma You have held my trust more than any man. I'm bad at reading. So tell me why. Why have you betrayed us? Why have you betrayed me? Your Highness. No, my queen is mere. It is your own fault. You are too lovely, my queen. Carly? The first time I met you 20 years ago now, I saw you in the garden of this very palace, and I was bewitched. Your pale beauty far surpassed that of any flower. I was in the grips of an unforgivable desire. You were the wife of my king, to whom I'd sworn life and loyalty. I told myself a grand lie that day. I told myself I could be happy. Simply, simply, uh, could be happy simply serving you as your most loyal knight. After years of duty, years of service, years of, of silence, I became aware once more of the feelings I'd buried deep within myself. How could I leave this world without expressing my true desires? Could anything be more desolate, more devoid of meaning? That is when I made my decision. I would follow my heart and claim your hand as my own. Carly, you forget yourself. You ruin our country and kill our countrymen. Did you think I would be pleased? Did you think I would love you for this? I need no country. I care nothing for my countrymen. I can see nothing but you, if you would only be mine. Carlisle, Car Carly. <coughs> Whatever your name, your name that is stupidly spelled that I don't know, and I hate life because of it. You make me feel so sad. Wah. Alright. Oh, great. Blind spots. This is one of the things that makes Fire Emblems fun. Blind rooms, where any number of miscreants can be hiding. Yes, we, uh, we adore that. Oh, man, there's a lot of blind rooms. That could be challenging. Hey, look, it's Izmir. Izmir. The Queen of Jahana, she is known as the Queen of the White Dunes. The King, the Queen, the Kingdom's highest authority. She is a popular ruler of great virtue. Right. Oops. You have sword skill? Can I give you a sword and let you go buck wild? Your stats suck. Never mind, I'm not doing that. Carly, Carlisle. You know, you're, you're just going to be Carlisle because it's the only thing I can ever think of. Former leader of Jahana's army. He lost himself for love of his queen. Sounds like something out of Shakespeare. God, he's a sword master. Oh, wind sword. Capable of indirect attacks. Great. Great. Mm. As far as the sword master goes, though, his stats aren't aren't uh, aren't very good. We can take him. 
I have full confidence in our own Swordmaster, who we have seen come through thick and thin, Joshua. Joshua's stats are already sur well, almost surpassing that guy, so Joshua can totally take him. Especially because Joshua's level is so much lower than him. He's, he's, he's clearly the superior swordsman. Now, this battle looks like it could be a little bit of a challenge. Let me see what we've got to bring here. Alright, well, I don't foresee having too much difficulty, so I'm pretty sure I can leave Dazla behind and instead bring you in. And, uh, that's about all I'm gonna make. That's like, the only change I'm gonna make, I believe. I don't think I have anything else I really wanna do. Maybe drop Ainz off, but I kinda like having Ainz in the party, because there's not really any other person in the party who I... Like, I mean, we're not saving these levels after all. And there's no one else that I really... think has potential. In, uh, in hard mode, I mean, we've already seen Ford, Kyle, and Franz kind of just drop off the face of the earth. They're, they suck. You know, it's not, that's not sugar-coated. They suck. Their stats are terrible. Tana's maybe the only other person who I would want to give a shot to, but I mean, and, and Marissa, too. I, Marissa would probably have great stats. I mean, she's already coming in at really good stat levels, so I mean, Marissa and Tana are essentially the only other two characters I even care about. I guess I could drop Ainz for them, because, I mean, Nemi is the better archer by far. Um, I think her stats are already pretty, pretty close to, well, for her to be level 13 with these stat sets, I'm pretty sure she's going to be better than him. Besides which, she also has a, a support. There's no one really, Ainz could support Tana, but they would never be together, really. It, it'd, it'd be an awkward pairing, so we can drop that off. Um... I could leave Garrick behind, and then bring... Who else was it? Who else have I been talking about Marissa along? But I don't really have swords, as we have well established, and because of that I can't really justify bringing Marissa with us, because I don't have swords. And she'd have to use the... Sh the only sword she'd have that she could use would be the Sham Samasha, Shamasha, whatever the hell you pronounce that as. And that just, it's not gonna work out for us. Let's bring a Thunder with us. I hate Thunders, but we'll bring it with us. There are instances where a thunder will work better than an ale fire, and I wish to capitalize on that. Oh goodness, you're out of a, you're out of. Do we, do we have any other kinds of swords? Any at all? Uh, broken crap. All right, take the steel, take the iron. That gives him what, 11 shots? All right, he's got 11 shots. You know, that's uh, that's okay. We can make do. We can make do. Slim, Javelin, Heavy Spear. The only thing that doesn't make sense is the Heavy Spear, but I'll leave that on you anyway, because it can be useful, and uh, we might run into one of those situations where it will be useful. Who else is low weapon supply here? You have a Silver Sword, you're fine. Joshua, uh, is there anything you can use? I'm thinking of giving him the Silver Sword, but if I can... Hmm... I'm gonna keep the Silver Sword for now. We'll, we'll put that on someone else when we need it. Which means uh, it'll be one of the only weapons I have left for next mission, which we won't see, because next mission is whenever Ephraim and Erica meet, we're going back to the normal file for that one. Um, and yeah, continuing on our normal file. Now I'm gonna check my map, which is kind of sad, because Joshua's a badass on this file. Like, a super duper badass, as is loot. So it's kind of sad to me. Now we gotta set up formations, which is always a fun thing. So, I'm gonna guess you have a door key. You do, and he probably does as well. So, Joshua and Nemi, er, <coughs> Colm and Nemi in the back here, they are gonna go up to that doorway, probably by themselves. I'm about to sneeze. I'm gonna try to stop myself from doing it. We'll see how that works out. And, alright, so I'm thinking I need to divide the forces here. And I'm what I'm thinking is, loot and arts war. We're definitely going one way, and Joshua and Nemi, or Josh, Joshua and Natasha, will go the other way. Well, Rachel will head with these two, and I'm thinking Tethys will go with the, whatever party you and it's going with. I'm not sure exactly where I'll send him, uh, and I'm not really sure. I'll, I think I'm just gonna send. I think it's gonna be. I think all of these guys are gonna go this way. And these three will go up this way. And these two this way. Actually, I've decided against that. I'm actually going to send Garrick up with these two. So it'll be a party of five going going the long way. 
three going up north. Well, actually, they'll take along Erica, so it'll be a party of four going up north, but Erica's not going to fight because she's level 20. And a party of three going out the side pattern, passage. That's the plan currently. And I think it'll work. Now, I think that's all I needed to do. And we're ready to rock. So, kick ass, take some names. Oh, look, it's Renick. To arms, mercenaries, we're under attack. You there, ready your weapons. What? No! That was never part of the deal. The only fight I'm here for is with the locks of the treasure chamber. <laughs> Don't get so excited. I doubt your mercenaries will see any action at all once we've soldiers have finished them. Yeah, great. You go do that. <laughs> with all these soldiers around, I shouldn't have to lift a finger. I'll just sit here and wait for them to win the day. Then, I collect my pay. No more being ordered around by that selfish princess and her moronic bodyguard. This is the life. Lady Luck sure does love me. But something doesn't feel right. Well, I guess you're going to go with those guys, Rachel. That's okay, we can probably handle it ourselves on this side. Maybe Garrick should switch sides, head over to us, but nah, never mind. Go, Colm. Oh, Jesus. That's probably a bad sign. Longbow. Critical for six points of damage. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> I have done so much to you. Oh, wow, my weapon level increased. Interesting. Oh, I forgot to strip lines of his gear if I wasn't going to use him anymore. Curses. All right, Garrick, you have to get up here now. They're going to need your help here soon. And, of course, Rachel will have to follow. Now then. With all that said and done... Haha! <laughs> free XP! I want the free XP. Leave me alone. And he'll, he'll, he'll run back up and join these guys in a bit. I don't really want to give that guy first strike, but I also don't really care, so... Forward! These two will both rejoin us in a little bit, but I want more experience. Meh, meh. Uh, you can probably take him. Yeah, you definitely can. Alright, so you've got the door key. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, so he can definitely step in front of her. Alright. That was all I needed to know. Pass me the door key. Na, na, na. I'm a slayer time. Wow, and a critical on the first try. That is horrible for that gentleman. For now, he is dead. Now, he can attack her, but I mean, that'd be really stupid because, as we all know, Natasha has a stupidly high resistance. So, he'd be kind of stupid to do that. He'll likely go after Joshua, but that's still a bad move. Joshua's avoid is very high. And you can just stand wherever the hell you want. It doesn't really matter to me. Oh, hi! Hey, Carlisle. Impressive work you've done here. My compliments. I gave you everything I promised. I opened the hall to your forces. Yes, the palace is mine. My palace. Oh, how I do like the sound of that. Do whatever you want with the royal treasury. The only treasure I wish to leave here with is the queen of my heart. Oh yeah, about your queen. There's been a change of plans. <sighs> Don't move, Carlisle. You twitch, and the queen dies. Blackheart, what is the meaning of this? Oh, calm down. You'll get her back as soon as I'm done with her. Johanna's sacred stone is around here somewhere. I've got to find it and destroy it. I need this woman to guide me to its hiding place. Do not lay a hand on my queen! Don't get so incensed. I'm not going to harm her. I'm not like that freak Voltaire. I'm kind to women, to some extent. But if you make a wrong move, you'll lose your prize. Understood? Yes. There are some annoying pests outside who think to win back the hall. I want you to take care of them. Lose? 
and the queen will never be yours. If my queen comes to any harm in your care... Yes, of course. I know all about the might of your sword arm. As long as the sacred stone is destroyed, you'll get all you ask for. Yeah. Greetings, Prince. Let's get going. Kalik, you will put an end to this. Destroying the sacred stones is... <laughs> What's this? You still ill? You know, you're not very princely. Come on, follow me. Kalik. <laughs> I love how casual Kalik looks. It's just like, ah, get, you're, you're sick. Alright, let's just go on then. Ow! Sword Reaver? When did this happen? This is a mistake! I didn't know he had a Sword Reaver. How was I supposed to know? I didn't check before I opened the room that, that I couldn't see into. Well, this is bad. What the hell? I don't want the Sword Reaver that just almost killed me. I've got an Iron Axe. Well, I can take this guy. Don't critical. Well, I can take this guy. Yes, I didn't critical. All right. Good. That means only one more person can attack Comb. It's either going to be the Magician or the Dude with the Javelin. I'm hoping the Dude with the Javelin. Because I don't think Comb has any resistance. I'll be honest. Man, I'm wasting this beautiful Armor Slayer. I mean, I kind of have to because the guy with the Lance was pretty strong, but... Man, my armor slayer. Let's skip through this a little bit. These guys are weak, and we already know the outcome of this fight. Oh no! Yeah, there we go. That's what I was hoping for. Javi boy can't hit worth crap. He's an armor knight. Armor knights in this game have notoriously bad accuracy levels. No, you get back here! God dang it! Now I have to chase him down. Arrow. Quick. We must chase him down. That's for cavalry. Steel blade, 22. I I give you the advantage here. Amazing. All right, he needs healed. Oh goodness. Shoot. And yet I have to stick up with Renek here, who's going to be rushing. I mean, he's just gonna head straight- Oh, God, there's a lot of enemies over here. I need support. I need support. Somebody with actual skill is required. I, I recruit Joshua. Come over here. You get a follow. You get him moving again. Uh, Colm, for now I need you to back up. You'll need healed. And we'll have Tethys head down with that group now, because I need it. Which is depressing to me. And I guess Tana could take out these guys, but I mean... You know, I don't want to do that. Um... You and run off. <sighs> Fine, Tana will take it. Actually, Tana won't. She's just going to stand here with the Javelin, which will force that guy to fight her. Um, it's a better tactic. And you two can go off and do your own thing, because I'm pretty sure that you could take on the entire world single-handedly, so do that. This will do 32 if I wanted to. Alright, go. Whoop, dorky. And we can't do anything currently, we have to just sit here and wait. Because I'm not going to, uh, I can't trade and do the door trick, because I didn't, I didn't want to take the damage. So, that's fun. We know who Renick is. I'm not going to read his description to you. Ow. Ow. At least you got hit by a Javi. Alright, so he's up there. He's going to go to the next one. we got to hurry. This is a horrible level. Um, that's not really worth it. Can you... You can't take him in one shot with that thing. Well, but you, you can definitely land twice. I have, I have more faith in you than, than that. So, go and do it. And boom. She's victorious. Now then. You need to keep pace with Joshua because, uh, obviously, you know, he's kind of, uh, he's kind of needs your support. But Garrick will actually be the man to kill this dude. That I lied. Garrick will not do it. Yep. 
I don't want him. Uh, there. Okay. I think Nemi can actually take this guy out more effective than anyone else that I'm willing to use in this scenario. You critical? Well, that was unfortunate for that guy. All right. Might as well get him healed. Do these dances. And now you're going to move up. Garrick is going to move up. And Garrick is going to have... Yeah, he's got his iron blade out. And then Joshua is going to come way up. Well, no, you're still in the three block radius. So he'll come way up with his iron sword equipped. And he should be able to lure every single one of these assholes out to fight him. And they're not going to be able to kill him. I mean, it is Joshua. Now you... Pop the door. Oh, well. Loot to the rescue. Do, 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 do. One shot, one kill. Well, I think they've got. I think they can take it. It's all magic users, so it's actually the best room for them. Kind of interesting how that one worked out. And, um, yeah. Oh, God, he had a killing edge. That could have been very bad had someone other than him, other than, uh, you know, our prized moneymaker got in first. God. He, Josh was ridiculous. And... You, they're all just gonna die horribly, so... I think I got, like, one experience per thing. Oh, he lived by one? That's unfortunate. Ah, he's moving so fast! Alright. Use the longbow. Eh, eh. And then you'll you'll take out that one. So if you're gonna take out that one, Garrick will take out this one. Oh, but if he takes out that, yeah. So that's a shame. I'll have to move. You move up one. She comes up and she dances for you. That should give you enough movement then to go to where this guy's standing after Joshua kills him. Well, I got one experience point for that guy, so that was depressing. Oh, but you're not strong enough to do this? Why do you have to be a failure? Nah, nah. Grrr. And Rennick will probably run and open up this door. From there, we'll, 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 where will he go? Not quite sure. He'll definitely open that door. It's just a matter of where will he go to after that. Thieves in this game really like opening up doors for no real reason. Oh, who's going to run to these stairs after doing that? Okay. Either that or he might come around and try to open this door and go wherever the hell else. But I highly doubt that. That's not... That's not something the game makers would do. They wouldn't make their thief take up the most retarded patterns ever. They're not that dumb. Okay, so you go over here and you kill this one. And then that'll give him the support that he needs to effectively kill this guy. points of damage. I'm gonna use the shine because the other thing wouldn't have enough power to kill wouldn't have enough left to kill that guy, so. You and You really should heal. Oh, you don't have any healing. Um Let me borrow this. And by borrow, I mean drink. I'm going to steal this from you and drink it. And we'll wait there. So, man, catching Rennick is going to be tough. Tethys is pretty close, though. I mean, I can, I can probably get a little bit of a boost. Stop that. Die horribly. Huh, he's not going to open that door for me? Well, thanks, Rennick, you ass. Hate you, too. Hold on. Is the audio being recorded? Yeah. Okay, now I just need to make sure. Something that I should have checked... Something that I should have checked long prior, but I didn't. Okay, so how do I want to do this? Garrick, you can you kill this guy. 
Okay, now Nemi will come up to here. That's actually a waste to just equip the Iron Bow and wait. <sighs> Who's this? Steel Lance we can take with our lovely Armor Slayer that still has use left, and you can just walk in. I just want you to kind of walk in. I don't, I don't know where to put you. How far can you get to? Up to where Garrick is standing, so if she moves... We'll put her here, we'll put you up to where Garrick is. Or maybe even dance for Garrick, I don't know. This way Garrick can, uh... Can walk to here. And this will allow her to get within range of supporting him. And that is, uh, uh that's about the best I can do. Are you a new one? You are. Well... Uh, I'm in pain. I don't know if I can really take him. Or in the, well, like, okay, let's rephrase. I can definitely take him, but I don't know how wise it is. I mean, because I'm in, I'm injured. But uh, you know, thunder. Yeah. There. And you get up here, little small fry. Okay. Okay. The middle is the only advance that hasn't really been able to do anything, on account that it's down to two people who I'm not really willing to use. Well, I'm willing to use Tana, but there's no way she could do the job that's needed of her. Do, 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 do. Oh, that is, uh, that is lovely. Well, that is why I did bring the heavy spear, but I figured it was these knights, which I'm pretty sure it is these knights and not the opposite knights, because those aren't knights, they're cavaliers. There's a complete difference between them. Alright, we're in danger. If I... hmm... if I... I don't know what to do. If I move in here, potentially, they'll go after the other group, which is what I want. But it's highly unlikely that they're going to be that dumb, so... Especially because this other group has to keep moving. I can't stop them. They gotta go. They gotta go, gotta go, gotta go, 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 gotta go, gotta go, gotta go, go, go. Man, they just had to make this like the most annoying freaking chase ever, didn't they? They have like troops blocking the path. Like, I have Tethys here, but there's no point. I can't, I can't boost her speed because there's enemies flying on the path. But after this guy is dead, and this guy is dead... Oh crap, there's another guy. Well, I might be able to catch Renick if I do this right. What's your movement? Six. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then if I, if I boosted you a little bit... No, there's no way. He's gonna get away. Because his movement is also six, which is stupid to me. There's nothing I can do. I'm sort of feeling like I should just quit and try again, because I just don't even care to continue this. I'm not going to catch him. There's literally no way. Her speed is stupidly slow. And I didn't know that he was here prior to coming to the... Alright, restarting. Yep, I'm restarting. I'll come back to you guys whenever I'm here. Whenever. Okay, so I totally caught him. It's just... The problem's going to be getting out of the situation I'm in. But I think I can do it. Nyeh. Aha! So this is where you've wandered off to, Rennick. Princess LaRachel... Uh, come with me. Wait, hold on now. Go with you where? Look, I'm sorry, but I've been hired by the Great O Empire, and... Hello, I'm talking to you. Rennick, whatever is the matter? I promise to listen to your story later, but now we must be going. No, I'm no servant like that cook Dazla. I'm a mercenary. I escorted you to Renai like I was hired to do, didn't I? You have no right to drag me across creation without any pay whatsoever. Is this about wages? I believe you re I bleh bleh. I can't speak. I believe you received ample compensation. Ample? Do you even know what that word means? You're the Princess of Ralston. I thought working for you would pay well. Yet your purse strings are knotted tight, and I've been Yet your purse strings are knotted tight, and I've almost been killed so many the joy that comes from doing good is not something that can be purchased. There, all better. Let's go. No! 
I said I don't want to. I'm a spoiled kid. Riding about with you is... And there she goes. Oh, by the stones. Why did I ever take that job in the first place? We must hurry, Renick. Right, right. I'm coming. He gives in so easily. It's like, why? Alright. What's your health at? Dang, Joshua. Alright, well, I'm sorry. I can't insist. Go forth. This is quite a pickle, isn't it? Because <laughs> this guy's going to be a problem, and this guy's going to be a problem. And yet somebody has to pick La Rachel up, because, I mean, this guy's here like, Look at me, look at me, I'm a jerk. Okay, so you can kill him. Nah, nah, nah. I'm not sure if we've ever seen Renick attack. This is a rogue's attack pattern, so I'm, so I'm gonna show it. This is how rogues attack in this game. It's actually pretty cool. I like it very much. Alright, so skip through that then. And you come up. Now, if I... He has a steel lance, so I need to give you the... I need to make sure your armor slayer is gonna be equipped for this, so... Walk up here. Before you, before you rescue her, get the armor slayer equipped. Now that he's boxed in, he can't attack her. He has to attack one of the two guys who can clearly best him in a fight. I will also allow him to throw an axe at this man, because I don't really want either one of those two to get the kill. And if I figure out that I do want one of them to get the kill, then I can control that. So that's what we're doing here. And of course, we had, we had to come back this far, so I have to go and do all this stuff again. Drat, alright, I'll fire him. I want him dead in one turn. I don't want to use two on him. I don't want to give him a chance to fight back. <laughs> I'm a jerk. There's a completely good reason for my jerkiness, but we're not going to that right now. Alright, let's go, Ewan. Forward. I'll come as well. Drat, he didn't just do what I wanted him to do. Now he's dead. You see what happens? You see what they make me do? Ow. Wow, even while you're carrying someone, you're fast enough to double. That's kind of crazy. Wow, ow, my face. I'm in pain. Nee. Alright, no, wrong. No, wrong. Stupid. Right, give me that. And usage. And, uh, you, you can just walk over here and murder that poor fellow who's just wandered out of those staircase. He, he doesn't even know what hit him. You know, he's like, lightning indoors, that's unbelievable. <laughs> Dead. That's all that happens. It's kind of sad, actually. But, you know, such is the way of life. And I will drop her. That's not where I wanted to drop her, because it's a completely horrible place. Oh, great. Somebody move Renick. He's in my way now. <laughs> <sighs> Dang it, and you're not even you're not even good enough to pick him up and carry him. Alright, well. Anyone need healed? You do. I shall mend your wounds. Huzzah. Man, I really want to kill him with something other than the armor slayer, but it's just not gonna happen. Alright. And then you can go right here and be like, yo, come fight me. Do they just have iron? Do they no one have a longbow? Alright, you can just walk up there and be all like, Yo, come fight me. With the iron bow out. And be like, Yo, come fight me. And, uh, yeah, that's all we really gotta do. I'm not gonna go fight these people. They're crazy. Yay! They came and fought me. Oh, cool, those guys are here. Let's see which group they go after. I'm sort of hoping they come up this way so I have people to murder. Because we all know I like to murder. Yeah. Getting nothing for this. 
Alrighty then. Garrick. You're holding Rennick, yeah. Drop drop him. Drop him there. Arrows away! And... Up we go. I wish to go pick some flights. Oh yeah, by the way. Because I don't know if you guys remember, but rogues don't need lockpicks to open up chests and doors. And they're actually pretty badass in this game. Um, other games, the level up for a thief was assassin. That has been changed. Assassin is now a level up for. We've already we already know this, but I'm just reiterating in case someone's forgotten or something. Assassin is now a level up for a myrmidon. So now the thieves become rogues and are like, haha, I don't need lockpicks because I'm boss. And that's that. It's kind of cool. I like it. I think it, I think it's a much better system than the prior than the one prior to this because uh, Fire Emblem Seven is the one that that was prior to this. Fire Emblem Six is actually prior to Fire Emblem Seven because you know Six Seven. Um, although although Seven is a prequel to Six, it, Seven comes after Six, so it's, it's strange. You know, sometimes it's how games are. It's kind of confusing. But uh, in Six, there was no level up for Thief. In Seven, the level up for Thief was an assassin, and you needed a fell contract for it. And it wasn't actually that advised. It made a thief a badass killer in some ways, but in other ways it lowered their ev evasion rate and it kind of hurt them as well. Um, and in this game, the level up from thief is to rogue, and that's actually a good thing to do, as the thief just becomes a major badass at that point. So, glad we went over all of that. And now I'm going to kindly wait here and see where these stupid horsemen go. It'll be interesting to see what path they choose. Oh, they're, I think they're I think they're coming both ways. Well, that wasn't that's not advised. Now they're going to die horribly, even more so than what they would have died. I kind of feel bad for them. Note: I don't actually feel bad for them at all. Okay, go there. You run over to here. And she'll come up and be all like, Oh, Joshua, you need to move again. And Joshua will be like, Yeah! And then he will murder this gentleman. Luna. Pfft, lame. And that's that. No, oh, I guess Garrick should wait and uh, jack the dude that's coming up, huh? And you know why? Because Garrick has a Zanbato. And that just makes everything hilarious. Now then, these horsemen are going to come in. Iron Lance, Iron Lance, back up. Let them come. We're not going to engage them until I get. I can see how good Tina does against them, because that's what I really care about. Ah, when did you get there? Die. Stay out of the staircase. Stupid people. I want to be part of the party. I'm going to jump into the staircase. Oh god, now there's a lot of knights. Oh god, he's got a berserk. Well, I'm glad he missed. That would have been terrifying. Um, Joshua berserked? Kind of a big deal didn't even realize that we got into the point of the game that they were going to start bringing out Berserk Stabs. Luckily, he has no chance of... Oh, he's dead. <laughs> well, that was fun. Man, we had a mend. I really want Joshua to just walk in here and just screw everybody. Single-handedly. <laughs> well, not single-handedly. He has to bring, you know, Natasha with him for the boost. But otherwise, it's single-handed. Man, these guys actually do quite a bit of damage, huh? And I think... Heavy Spear is not good against them. Yes, see? They weren't. They don't mean that knight. They mean the other knight, which is dumb. Javelin. Ewan! You can do... No, you can't. You know who can do it? She can, and she can totally just... You know, just go down and kill them. Just kill them. Kill them all. How much damage do you do with this? 29. Screw it. And you walk down and assist, and... She has a longbow, or he had, well, the archer has a longbow, so, yeah. And I'm not really one for waiting. Da -da 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 -da. Yeah. So, what are we going to have all of this this crew do? Oop. Did I do that? Yes, I did that. And everybody else can just wander around and do whatever it is that they want to do. I really could care less at this point what my team does. And I know that sounds horrible, but it is kind of truthful. Yeah, these guys can't even move. I don't gotta worry about that. Yeah, that's about all I can do. 
Ah, my face. Yeah, time he misses, because he's a terrible person and can't hit worth crap. And Zonbato. Isn't the Zonbot Okay, isn't this from Naruto? The Zonbato? Because that one guy has a sword that he calls the Zonbato, and Kakashi Sensei gets his ass handed to everybody, essentially gets their asses handed to him by that guy, because he's kind of a boss. I believe that happened. Forward. One, two, three. So move up one. Then she dances. This encourages you to move again, and you're all like, whoop de doop I can kill this guy. And so you do, and he's dead, and we get a door key. Guess what? Those are a thing of the past. We now have a rogue. We don't care about doors anymore. We don't even need your lockpicks anymore, Calm. We are that badass. As soon as Rennick can get down to these other locks, doors, and deal with them. Unfortunately, that's going to be a while. And it looks like the cavalry have all decided that Garrick is scary with his Zonbato, and no one wants to no one wants to handle that. So they're all going after him now, because no one wants to handle that alone. But they think strength in numbers is actually going to count for something in this fight, and it's really not. And they're going to learn that, but you know, they we, we got to give them some false hope. I'll just use the shine because I don't want to break my last lightnings. Those are worth something. I may need them later. Let's just see how good this heavy spear is. It's actually pretty decent. So if I can lure one of these one of these guys off, which actually isn't hard, I'm gonna lure this one. And if they don't move, that actually makes this ten times easier, and I can have you and kill them all, which would be kind of hilarious to me. So, yeah. What's everybody doing up here? Everybody's stationary because we're waiting for our badass to clear the way. Got it. And Garrick is level 14. Oh my goodness, he's killing people. He's killing people. Everyone, oh he's ending everybody's lives. Doesn't look like they want to move. They are cowardly. So I am going to prepare my team for breaching. And what's going on up here? Oh, Garrick, they're not. They don't want to come fight you anymore. Garrick is actually taking kind of a pounding. I might want to withdraw. Bye. We'll get him healed. Oh, I can't reach? Well, we're not going to heal you anymore. Have fun! We'll heal him on one of the other turns. Come over here. Come over here. And get danced for. Oh, wow, you, she leveled up. Cool. And you're going to go over here now. And Rachel's going to heal you. I misclicked because I was trying to do it fast. I should have learned my lesson by the other 1,000 times. And it hasn't worked out for me. But I haven't. And now we'll just let the enemy have their turn. They're getting Zonbatoed. Well, they totally got Zonbatoed, and they were sad. Now, Garrick, you need healed, so I suggest you get all the way back up here. She'll be glad to heal you. And you can come over here and heal him. Because I, I, I failed horribly to try to do that last time. <sighs> One, two, three. Yeah. Okay. So, I, I don't need the. I don't need that. I don't need the defense. I just want to kill them both in one turn. So, armor slayer is out, right? I only got three shots with that, which is the problem. So it might actually be hard to kill it all. Kill them all in one turn. And I'll dance for you for no apparent reason. And everybody else is ready to go as well. So. We are ready to kick ass. Now then, let us see what we can do over here. Dang it, we can't even do anything useful. Ugh. Oh. See, I knew something like that would happen. That's why I didn't just rush in there. Bastards lied to us. I really don't trust you. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, I just, I can't. You're lame. Give me that. I think of honor is actually all I really need. Oh, man, that'd be stupidly risky. Why? Dang you, game. Dang it. And I really want to do it, too, which is the problem.
I still can. Ha <laughs> ha! Fuego! Yeah! And iron and axe reaver. <laughs> That's not gonna help you, people. What the hell? God, the game clearly doesn't know that mages are where it's at. Nobody uses axemen. I'm sure some people do, but I think axemen suck. So I never do, personally. Iron bow. Dead. And now it's time that we all move in for our murdering of enemy leader. Yeah, Garrick. Yes, we have a large force. The enemy is scared. They are going to start running for the hills. Undoubtedly. I meant to switch your- oh, you're on Iron Sword already? <laughs> I forgot I broke your armor slayer. Well, that's fun. And... end my turn. Ready? And fly over and say, how do you do, sir? But... I don't want Ewan to get the ex to get the kill. Ewan just wants experience. Now Tana can get the kill. Yay for Tana! Oh, another door key. I don't need those. Okay, so everybody is now dead. Hor everybody has now died horribly, and uh, the day is good. So that's fun. We need Renek down here, but of course he's dilly dallying up here with all of his friends, and it's just a shame. Oh, I thought this was water for some reason. I didn't recognize that that was grass. I thought it was green water. Oh, don't I look stupid. Steel, heavy spear, iron. Okay. Same strategy as before. But he actually has surprisingly low attack power. I could put him here. He'd do better. Nah. Iron out. And we'll have Garrick back here for assistance later if needed as well as Renick, but Renick's not actually there to help he's just there for once we get them all dead he can run past and go do what he needs to do that's what Renick's real job is that's always been Renick's job huh silver bow well you missed god that's embarrassing I'm going to come kill you this isn't exactly advised but I'm gonna do it anyway Oh man, that had to hurt. That sounded brutal. Let's just be honest here. Oops, I didn't mean to I didn't mean to actually attack, I just meant to plug the hole with him, you know? And block. Um Well that's great, I'll heal him. No worries. No mistakes were made, it's all a myth. Alright. Do you a javelin? You do. Huh. Maybe I maybe this was a little bit less biased than what it was than what it was previously thought. But I'm okay with it overall. I just want the experience points here. Uh we could open this door, but I don't really see a reason, because Renick can just come around and save us the trouble of using the door key. Actually no he can't, because I chose the wrong path. Oh god dang it, Renick! Renick, this is your fault. This isn't my fault, this is your fault. I have to go all the way back around. Jeez, this is going to take forever. Alright, how many door keys do we have? <sighs> One. Pop the lock here. Now fly away. Jeez Louise. I gotta kill a bunch of people now, too. 18 times 1? Dang it, it was only times 1. <laughs> I am a genius fire. Let's go, gents. I'm going to kill you both while we wait for Renek. This is going to take forever to get Renek up here. Uh. Fuego, fuego, more fuego. Everybody is dying horribly. Alright, Renick. Um, go. And Tethys, assist. And continue. God, this is going to take a long time, isn't it? It really is. He's got to go all the way around. And he can't even beat these guys by himself. So it's going to have to be Party A over here. He's going to have to come in and be all like, doop, doop, doop. And wipe them out. Jeez, my life is terrible. Where's that other door key? It's on you. Get up here. You two might as well stay there. I'm done with you. And... Uh, Garrick, could... why didn't they continue to advance? Are they afraid now? Did they get frightened by my impressive might? No, 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 no.
Well, this is going to be a long fight. They have uh, blocked us with people I can't kill effectively. That's okay, though. See, look at the time it's taking us. Get out of here with your hand axe. No, God, why, why? I hate you. I don't want you to do it. You already have, like, stupid amounts of experience. You're level 3. Oh, you have to do it. He can't even make it. Burn. Burn for your sins. Oh, they have a door key over there. Well, we don't need yours anymore. Huh, what happens if I walk into this room through the stairs? <laughs> that would be amusing. Colm, I need you to move over so that I can gain the uh, support bonuses that we have. Iron bow. Boink. Boink. Are we A rank? That's probably why I can take that guy. Oh, yeah. My face is bleeding. I'll just let him attack me. My face is bleeding too much for me to go and do it. Wait a second. Garrick. That's brilliant. So if I kill this man... So if I kill this man... Garrick can... That's not Garrick. Garrick can kill this one. Man, it works perfectly. Can I heal anybody yet? Oh. Well, I'm not going to walk out in front and get an axe chucked at me. I'm not that stupid. These guys, nothing tricky? Alright, cool. You, go forth. That is going to be a really long trek. Alright, unlocked. Getting ready to go at that dude, and, uh... Re-equip the iron here. And then she walks up and she's all like, Oh no, I feel so bad for you. And she heals him. Then La Rachel's like, She's not the only person who can heal. The ha! And then Garrick will stay where he is. Even though these guys have ranged and can totally hit her, I don't think anyone can really kill her. And then I immediately lie. Like, I immediately take that back and I send him out. Because that's just the way I roll. And you can dance for him for the experience, no one cares, and Rennick is still going to go all the way around, and it's kind of ridiculous. And they just failed three times in a row, which I find amusing. Oh, there's extra enemies. Oh, the glorious glory of glory. Die, die. Now how am I supposed to get around, because there are people here, and they clearly want my blood. I'm going to send you to go intervene. Um, go block them. Renick is going to keep moving anyway, though. Even if he has to fight them, I will let it happen. I do not even care. I am a crazy man! And, uh, Joshua, what is your- Wow, your experience is stupidly high. 13, 12. You know what, I want them both dead. I will use you. And you shall assist in the murdering that is commencing here. And that is just how it is done. As you can see, the enemy has been kind of demoralized. They are very sad, and there's only like four of them left, and it's just it's just a shame, really. It's just a shame. Actually, there's more than four, because there's still that one blind room that I haven't gone into yet, because I keep forgetting about it. Lots of sense of people that way. Um, loot, you're gonna go solo that room. Actually, you can't, because you have to go and you have to help Idiot get down here. I almost forgot. Curses. Uh, these guys aren't really going to do anything. I guess we'll just move around a little bit, preparing ourselves and such and such. Oh, sadness. Ho, ho, hum. Dancing for the experience, blah, blah, blah. Other words to the song... Yay. I will kill that man. Okay, now that they're done spawning, yeah, and yeah, and yeah, um, that guy needs to die. I'll kill him. Yay, I'm not level three. I'm the greatest swordsman ever, and people will remember my name. Walk up one, you fool. And you walk up and get cheap experience. And they were all ready. So now it's just down to Rennick getting all the chests. And 
us cleaning out this room, which I am so not sending Artur in there first, because he cannot be trusted to do it on his own. And that is a shame. I don't like to admit it. And you will go there with your fire, and you'll be all like into the fire and flames, and someone will fall for that and die horribly. And that is kind of the plan. And we cannot get in. Apparently there is a door here or something. We aren't quite sure what the deal is. I won't pick that lock. I got some odd amount of cash that I honestly didn't care about. Because I'm a bad person. Go this way. Uh, apparently we're going to need your door key for something else. Come on, Renick. And I don't... There's no point really pausing this, because, I mean, I, I want to show what's in these chests as well. But the action has slowed down quite a bit. There's no more action Jackson going on here. That is like the oldest thing I could ever pull out of my hat. Alright. Man, this is going to take forever. Why is there a magic secret... No. Why is there a magic secret door there? You know what I just realized? I have to claim the throne after I kill the guy, I believe, so... <laughs> I do need you up there, Marissa. So I might as well start doing that while we go to that other room. Why do I honestly have to go all the way around? I am upset. Kind of annoyed. Pick this lock. Oh, look, it's a dragon spear. Holy doodly. Send the hammer in. Oh, wait, that's a hammer in? Oh my god, that fixes equipment. Do I have any really good equipment that's almost broken? I don't believe I do anymore. I think I've let my really good equipment be broken. Damn it! I could kill him. There's really no reason to not kill him. I could totally kill their leader right now. I mean, all that's left is moving Mar Erica. Did I call her Marissa again? Seriously? God dang it! All I need to do is move Erica all the way out there. Energy ring. Send that back. I don't want that in your pockets. I'll forget about it if it's in your pockets. Oh my goodness! I'm a coming. You know, okay, we're going to kill this guy, and then I'm going to probably pause it. And, uh, I'll show this room. For, uh, like, right after I'm, right after, you know, soon. <laughs> Alright, so, let's compare these guys. This is important to me. I need this compared, right? So, you see, he's got, he's got some decent stats. 13, 18, 19, 8, 9, 11. Yeah, boom, blowing it out of the park. Joshua is just a much better fighter. And it's going to be proven in just about 8 seconds. Move up one. Huh. It's definitely been proven. Oh, wow. Well, that'd, be, that'd be kind of ridiculous, wouldn't it? I might very well kill him in one, like, one run if I tried that way. I don't want to do that. Let's do it normally. You. Could it be? Carlisle. I don't know my voice. Carlisle. How did this happen? You taught me how to wield a blade. You of all people. You've returned. But now, it's too late. It's far too late. To battle. Meh. Well, I did not know that these two knew each other. Awkward. Is, is there ever, ever, has there ever been any, oh, wandering swordsman from Shahana? I guess, okay, that could probably, all right. Whatever. Come up here as well in case I choose to use you for support. I'm not going to use him. It's a, This is 1v1. Especially now. This is mentor-student kind of fight. That makes it all the more intense. I enjoy that. You, I think there's a treasure chest down here. I want you over here. Oh, he's healing. He's a cheater pants. I, I just wanted the two of us. That, that's probably his generic fighter dialogue. You know, for non-specific enemies. They like to do that. They like to give you the the non-generic, and then if you fight them again with the same character, they give the generic. I don't know why. It's interesting. To battle and victory. Sword fight. Nyeh. Nyeh. Ow, he actually hit me. <laughs> I want to show his, uh... I want to show his wind attack. So. And 
It looks like Air Calibur. Uh, no, not Air Calibur. It looks like Excalibur. That's what it looks like. The spellbook Excalibur. Do you guys remember that from a while back? Probably not. Um, I don't need to heal him. He can only take 18 points of damage. It's it's pretty static. He uh, the other guy has no crit crit chance or anything like that. So, <sighs> everybody gather round. God damn it, Artur, you're so far back. God damn it, Renick, you too. And he's healing because he's a jerk, and he's still losing because he sucks. <laughs> oh no, my eye! My eye on sword! No! That's it. Game over. Game over, man. Game over. Ow. Oh man, I don't want to. I don't. Wanna, I will be a wussy, and I will. I will wussy out. It was just in case I died. I mean, I know it would have been much more cool had I gone in there with the nine HP, one hit to win it. You know, who would score that one hit? Both of us having barely any chances for it. It'd be kind of cool. But I am a wussy. Queen is mere. I am dying. <laughs> Level 4. My goodness, look at those stats, man. He's crazy, man. He's a crazy man. He has low defense. I think I think I've mentioned that my main complaint about uh, Myrmidons and Swordmasters is the very low defense that they carry. And some people are like, well, they got the high crit rate, and they got the high evasion to make up for that. I'd prefer, instead of having a percentage, percentage chance of not taking any damage, to just have a... I can't take damage because I have 24 defense. You know what I mean? Just kind of my way. Why'd I waste my door key? Well, some questions can't be answered. Dang it, this guy's gonna live no matter what I do. Well, how he wouldn't have had been had this idiot been in the right place. Psh, dang it. Well, that shouldn't take much longer. That should be over in about 8 seconds. And then I can pause it till idiot face gets up to the throne. Go forth! Oh my god, she's gonna go a long way. You start working your way back, and you heal him for no other reason than I want the experience, and let's see, what else can I do around here? You fly in here and kill this guy, because I want you to get the experience. Amazing. And Renick pop this last chest. What is it gonna be? It's a guiding ring. I kind of actually need that. Interesting. Send back the spear. And now I'm going to pause it, and I'll be back when I get to the damn throne, which will take about three minutes. Alright. Finally there. Seizing the damn throne. There's another throne room? And another castle? Johanna's brilliant place. This is as good a place as any. Alright, your majesty. Hand over the sacred stone. I know nothing of the Sacred Stone's keeping place. Don't waste my time. My partner here sees everything. When the rebellion began, you went straight to the palace altar. You had hoped to prevent us from smashing the Sacred Stone. <clears throat> but you have the Stone of Jahana with you right now, don't you? Hand it over. Cooperate, and I'll let you live. I cannot. Oh, give it up, will you? I have no time for games, and the funny thing is, Carlisle is dead. He's not gonna come save you now. If you resist, I'm just gonna kill you and take it anyway. Hold! You mustn't harm her, Kalik. Whatever your face. Shut up, Prince. My orders come from higher than you. You're not going to start disobeying his word, are you? Last chance. Give me your sacred stone. I cannot. <laughs> a queen to the end. I like you. You've got guts. Goodbye. Close your eyes. One hit? One hit? I've looked at her stats. I don't think you could pull that off, I'll be honest. That, I, I'm pretty sure... I'm pretty sure that that's a lie. That's like whenever... Jafar killed, um... Whoever Matthew's girlfriend, Leah, Leah, Jafar killed Leah. Totally couldn't happen. Totally couldn't. Scripted event. Terrible. 
except this one's even worse because there wasn't even a crit chance. And that wasn't a crit or else we would have heard, you know, like the, the extra sound effect. Whatever. Totally, totally, he could not have pulled that off. When we go and fight him for realsies, for realsies, we'll see. He couldn't have pulled that off. And here's the sacred stone. That makes two for me. I'm on a roll now. Da -da -da -da. Two. So I'm gonna guess. What other stones? What stones have been lost? We broke. They broke Grados. They're about to break Johanna's. Oh, Frelia's. They broke Frelia's stone. And also Renai's, but I doubt that was him. So I'm gonna guess he's got Frelia and Johanna's. Not Ralstein's. Ralstein's stone can't be broken because there are Ralston knights and they're apparently good at fighting. By the way, Kalik, you're a douchebag for leaving your friend and saying, I'll handle the Ralston Knights, and then running like a girl. Anyway. Oh, he broke it. Oh, no. Terr terrifying. And another sacred stone has been destroyed. Grado, Frelia, and now Johanna. Oh, wait, no, they didn't destroy Renai. That's right. Only two stones remain. I don't know who's speaking. Uh, what should I do? Hey, look, you must help her. Didn't she just die? What? Just die, woman? Leave her. Let her last breath be a harsh and ragged rasp. She's not long for this world. Why, if you really wanted to help her, you'd deliver the final blow yourself. <laughs> no, I couldn't. What a joke. I have a little work to wrap up in the hall before we leave. You should hit the road pretty soon, too, Prince. I wonder where Queen Izmir is. I need a drink. I heard she was in the throne room, but there's no sign of her. And there's no sacred stone, either. We must search quickly. Yeah. I'll take my aw. Leon. Erica. Wait, Leon. Don't run away. My brother and I have been so worried about you. We know more than anyone the gentleness of your spirit. Your father is deranged, isn't he? That's why Grado invaded Renai, right? Tell me, Leon. Please, tell me what has happened. I'm sorry, Erica. I've wanted to see you in Ephraim for so long now. I wanted to see you so that I could apologize. The invasion of Renai. I couldn't stop it. I'm sorry, but I still cannot talk to you. Not yet. You... you have a reason, don't you? Mm. I can't talk about it now, but... I promise I will tell you everything someday. I see. I believe you, Leon. I must tell you, I'm a little relieved. I was afraid you'd changed as much as your poor father has. I'm so glad. Me too, Erica. No, you have changed. What? This doesn't make sense. These lines are freaking weird. You're even more beautiful than you were before. <laughs> Leon! I'm sorry, but I have to go. But please, remember this. This war started because I was too weak to stop it, but... I'll always be your friend. Leon. That's adorable. Erica, what are you doing? It seems Quinn... <laughs> I can't read. It seems Queen Izmir has been found. This way. Yes, coming. I need a drink. Queen Izmir? Is she... We're too late. Her injuries are... She will not last much longer. J Joshua. Wait, that's your son? Oh, well that... Yeah, that makes sense. Especially if Carlisle, Car Carlisle trained him. That makes sense. I'm not reading your lines. Queen is Mir. Oh, Joshua. Where is that boy? Queen is Mir. Please forgive me, Joshua. I was a foolish mother. I was so intent on being queen that I spared no time to be your mother. But I loved you nonetheless. Please understand. Oh, good. I was about to say, if they don't, if they really don't bring Joshua into this, that'll be really depressing. I know, Mother. Joshua. Joshua. It really is you. Joshua, my 
my son. I'm sorry, mother. I should never have left you. I have no excuse. I wanted to see the world as a man, not as a prince. I wanted to be worthy. I planned on returning to your side afterward. It was so foolish. If I'd been here, I could have... No, it's fine. You're here now. Listen to me, Joshua. The Stone of Shahana has been destroyed. The one who tempted Carlisle is responsible. What? Who was it? Carried a dark stone. It is the origin of all this. It should not exist. Joshua, you must... Our country. Our people. I understand, Mother. Thank you, Joshua. I have something... Something I must give you. This is... It's one of the sacred twin relics, unique to House Johanna. He who would rule our land must possess it. I've watched over it since your father passed away. I kept it safe and wait- I'm sick of reading this! I kept it safe and waited for this day to come. Mother, I have it now. I understand its meaning. Joshua, my dear sweet child, I'm dead. God, what the balls? That looks like a powerful sword. Also Excalibur. No one fucking cares about Excalibur. Huh. They have the exact same. Alright, that's pretty cool. Man, if I would have known Joshua was an important character, I would have actually tried to remember the first voice I gave him. But, he, they didn't seem like an important character to me at the time. I apologize. Stupid curveballs. Send Excalibur to the supply bank. It's been more than ten years. I'd grown tired of the formality of palace life, so I just left. I wrote a farewell and left the palace, taking nothing with me. I felt I could never understand the people while I stayed... While I stayed sequestered... Sequ yeah, I think that's how you pronounce that. In a castle. I abandoned my identity and roamed the continent, working where I could. I wanted only to be worthy of becoming king. I knew one day I would return. Just I didn't think it would be like this. Gods, I was so foolish. I was such a child, I see it now. Was I simply rebelling against my mother? Punishing her for tending to her duties? I almost said pushing her. You know, Joshua, you're gonna make a really lousy king because you have a really bad gambling problem. And I mean really bad. I was a fool, yes. But I learned much over these ten years. I have learned about the hearts of our people, how they need to be governed. I have learned how our country needs to change and to grow. I have learned much, but I have lost much more. Mother. Prince Joshua. I made a promise. I want to continue what she began. I will help defeat Grado. I will defend Jahan and her allies. I know it doesn't sound like, like me, but... On behalf of Frelia, I came to... I can't read! Literally, I need a drink! <laughs> On behalf of Frelia, I came to Johanna with a letter to the throne. I mean, you can tell, I need a drink. I can't... I can't read his lines. <sighs> I'm sorry, I'm trying to make the mucus... Uh, that's disgusting. I'm trying to make the mucus coat the black back of my throat so that I can speak. And I know that sounds disgusting, but that's kind of what I need to do or else I can't continue to read this. I give it to you. Prince Joshua of Jahana, let us fight together. Renai, Frelia, Ralston, and Jahana. Four nations, united! Yes, I suppose that's true, and my brother is with us as well. And if it were possible... Leon, I wish you could be here with us too. Then it would be... The five of us. But fortune can only have four. Fire! Fires have broken out all through the hall. What? God damn it. The curtains were soaked in oil, with torches set about the hall. It's a trap. Someone did this during all the fighting. You must flee, quickly, before the flames engulf us all. God damn it, Calic. It's totally him. Oh god, flames. Princess Erica, we must evacuate. I know. Joshua, we must go. Now. No. 
mother, forgive me. Nah. Is everyone well? Did anyone get left behind? Oh no! We left Natasha behind! Oh man! Actually, no. Natasha's not a. It would be more sad. It's sad because it'd be against Joshua, and there'd be like two people dying in Joshua's life. But who would be really sad is if. Oh man! We left Ewan behind! Because <laughs> he's a little kid. Alright. <laughs> we all made it out. It's so smoky that it's hard to tell, but we're here. What a cowardly act! Setting fire to the palace hall. But we've escaped without injury. The enemy's trap has failed. No, it hasn't. Assemble the troops now. The enemy is coming. What did you say? This is the reason for the fire. To drive us from the palace. They'll be attacking soon. No other plan makes sense. How is it that you know that? Princess Erica, I've just received word that greater reinforcements are headed this way. There are two armies, led by Generals Valter and Kalik. Damn it! Two armies. They are willing to send so many here and leave the capital defenseless. The capital has already fallen, genius. Why does everyone seem so distraught? It matters not who stands in our path. We shall smite them all with the power of righteousness. Princess Erica, it's going to be very difficult for us to continue. One of Greta's generals alone is more than a match for us. <laughs> That's a good one, Seth. Compound that with the exhaustion of our troops, and I'm not sure we can... Bah! With Johanna Hall in flames, we've no place to hole up and dig in for a siege. We have to retreat. We have to win ourselves time to form a plan. Grado sent two generals. What could be happening in their capital? And what of Ephraim? Is he still alive? brother. And we learned that Ephraim is alive because what do you know, Ephraim just comes in and destroys everybody's faces. And that'll be next episode. We'll be picking it up from Ephraim's point of view. Saving the team. And it'll be kind of cool. I kind of like the idea of it. Like, the thing is though, if we did it from Erica's perspective, all of our men would be there and we'd be defending. And, er and I'm pretty sure Ephraim's troops would come in on, on a turn and it would be It'd literally just be Ephraim, Dussel, and... There has to be another one. There has to be at least three, otherwise it wouldn't make sense. If there's just two guys coming in to be like, we're he being like, here we come to save the day! It just doesn't make sense. You know, it's not as fun. It has to at least be three. But I'm, I'm going to do it from Ephraim's path, because then it's then there's Ainz, Erika, and Slay. You know, up there, and Ephraim's whole crew comes in, and we're like, we're here, to, here we come to... And we're all like, here we come to save the day. And it's much more it's much more amazing. So that's what's going to happen. I'm going to go get a drink. And we'll do this tomorrow. All right? Sounds good to me. I need to save, though. So let's take a look at this next map. Because I do need to save and suspend data. So we'll take a look at this next map so we can see it from Erica's side. We're not going to read anything. We're not going to do anything. We're just going to take a look at it from Erica's side. See the very basic of the map. <laughs> So not reading anything. I refuse to. Um, let's just. I just want to see how it looks. So this is this is how the map would look. And Ephraim's men would come in from here. And oh wow, that looks fun. We'll be back here in a bit. I don't want to look at any. I don't want to look at too much. I just want to see how it would look from her, from her side. And I spit on my monitor. No. Ah, damn it. No. It's been there for a little bit too. So it's like, ah, it's partially dried. That spit should have stayed in my mouth and helped me speak more. Gergafriga. I need to... So I need to suspend. So, yeah, next episode, we'll be taking it up from Ephraim's path again. Which means the final battle won't actually be that hard. We, we were playing on hard mode and having a good time. Normal mode, it's not going to be as fun. That makes me kind of sad. Oh, well. Pressing start button, and we'll be picking up from here next time. Alright? Alright. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.